What's up, people? We're back for another reaction. This was sent to me by an email, John something or another. I can't remember. Anyway, um, I've got a couple emails uh, referring to animals and this and that. Uh, I mean, uh, I I try not to react to, to them. Let me fix my deal here. I try not to react to them because, for one, I'm a pussy. I ain't gonna lie, I'm a pussy. I'm a big tip bag when it comes to animals, especially abused animals. Uh, but uh, we'll get into it. Like, uh, subscribe. Uh, Lippy reacts to gmail.com. Thumbs up. Uh, Subscribe. Already, probably already said that. But uh, this dog has dementia, and it is uh, behaves in a heartbreaking way. So, hopefully, I'm not going to be a tip bag and and all that good stuff. But uh, here it is, um, and I believe in a glass of snow. So, if y'all like it then. Oh yeah, and I, and I pause, I pause. So if that's a big deal for y'all, then I don't know what it is. Uh, his dog has dementia. Uh, where'd it go? Dementia. He'll be walking and he'll freeze and he'll just sit there and not move. Sometimes five to ten minutes. I am Dennis Gerard, and this is Piper's story for GLP. Piper and his brother were dumped in a box at a shelter in Jacksonville, Florida. When they opened the shelter in the morning, the employees found them. I met Piper. He was really skinny and malnourished, but he came over to me, and we hit it off right there. The first few days was awesome. We showed him so much love. <laughs> my kids, my wife. Look at the best laugh. He was shy, but once he understood that we weren't hurt, it was wonderful. I always tell him he's a good boy and that I love him and that he's my best buddy. Piper likes to fake little injuries with his paw, knowing <laughs> that I'm going to give him a treat. Okay. You put your foot down. I fed the habit because it was so cute. Mm, you poor baby. You gotta get a dog treats. So, <laughs> man. I rescued him when he was two years old, and he will be celebrating his 17th birthday in about two weeks. Piper loves the mama. He's lost all his teeth about a year ago. Oh, what's wrong? Within the last couple of months, he's lost his vision and his hearing. It was about a one-year process going blind. As he was going blind, I worked on training him how to get from the bedroom to where his water dishes, where his food dishes, where the back door is. Less than two months ago, he went completely dark. And on top of that, he has doggy dementia. He's on downing right now. He forgets where he's going, what he's doing. At first, it was only for like a half hour a night, but now it's like three hours. He does not bark as a result of the dementia. At night, he'll kind of whine and cry. And I just hold him like I am right now, getting close to me, and he calms down. It's very scary for him and me. I think he's adapting better than I am. I worry about him all the time. You're the cutest puppy ever. I communicate with him by constantly touching him. He still has his internal clock. And he knows when it's time to eat and when it's time to go to sleep. It's a well, mine do. Mine, mine. They know what time to wake up. They know what time they're going to get fed. They know uh, the poopy in there. He he barks, and when it gets starting to get close, like hey. He's not, he's not gonna he's not fake an injury like like this dude but uh he'll bark uh to let you know hey man it's it's getting close to time so but uh yeah amazing his ability to walk around the house without hitting stuff when i come home from work i come to the garage door and he's in the back of the house and he'll literally wake up from under a blanket because he smells me and then he'll slowly walk to where i'm at to greet me I think about him all the time. And I am the whole world right now. And it's big responsibility. Still does it. In fact, I got some video of him today doing it. He'll lift his paw and I'll just stand there. He gets anything he wants. 
We got the best of everything. He gets the best health care. I'm spoiling him beyond imagination. Good, they deserve it. All right. I'm going to add that. You got it all discombobulated. Like, subscribe, comment down below. Thumbs up. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm a dog lover, so. Um, you know, you see them them ones that are. You see, you see them ones that get ran over or, you know, not leaving each other's side or, you know, or the, you know. That's bad. Um, the thumbs up. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm a big tip back, especially with animals. Y'all, good night.